So now it's time to install the GPU. So you're gonna to wanna to lay your case back down on its back. And if you haven't already done this yet, you're going to want to remove the metal slot brackets for the amount of slots that you'll need. For mine, I needed a few slots. So I actually needed three for mine and it's a thick boy. I think on the newer graphics cards, they only need about two. So you're gonna to wanna to remove two to three of those metal brackets on the back where the GPU is actually going to slide in. Also, one big thing to note here is you're gonna to wanna to install your GPU on the highest PCIe slot. This is typically the one with the highest bandwidth and speed. You don't want to put it on the lowest one either because if you have M.2s up at the top, those are going to take your bandwidth away from the ones on the bottom. So definitely just be sure to install your GPU on the top one to make sure that you're getting the maximum performance. So let's go ahead and grab your GPU and install it. So when you're installing your GPU, this will have a similar crack sound like the RAM, but it's not gonna be as loud, but don't be afraid to give it a little push, but just be gentle. So once your GPU is installed there, once you've heard that nice little crack and you think you're in a great spot, you're gonna wanna screw the GPU in using the screws. Again here, make sure not to over tighten, but just make sure it's sturdy and locked in. Now let's visually inspect that everything's good. Make sure that it doesn't wobble. If it wobbles, you've probably already broken something, but you should be in a good place now, but just make sure to visually inspect it before we move to the next step. 